guys, this is Bad Gamer Cat. Welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. We're here once again in the Oculus Quest 2 in the Blue Planet VR app. So, so far we have looked at Island Canyon, Prismatic, Tengbachi. So, let's try. Um. I don't know if these will work or not. I did try. To open this one here, short walk, and it didn't open. And I tried to open the longer walk and it didn't open. So let's try it again. Maybe I just didn't wait long enough for it to load. There, it's working now. So this is very pretty. So I don't understand how this is a short walk if we're standing in the air. It looks like there's a donkey or some sheep or something down there. Um, B. No, I don't want B. I want A. A is not moving me. Touch to continue to Guava Pintada. This is very beautiful. Wow. Okay. Uh, welcome to... I, I can't pronounce these words. Cueva Pintada Rock Art Site. Oh my god, that's beautiful. In Santa Teresa Canyon, located deep in the wilds of Baja, California. Known as the Great Murals, these pictographs date back as far as 2,000 years ago. Look for complex interplay of the split color human figures, monos, with animals and marine species, as well as an image of a large gray whale. Look for a continuation, a continuation icon to Pintada 2, a further area with a low overhang and densely layered artwork. Catch the icons below for more information. Press the trigger to hide this. So, okay. Oh! Okay, so, that's very cool. It's a little scale model. There are hundreds of painted rock shelters in the area surrounding the Cueva Pintada, but this one is considered to be on the great mural site, one of the great mural sites of the world, or on the great mural sites of the world. While the cave isn't that large, being around 40 feet deep at most, it has many well-protected surfaces that allow these ancient depictions to stay preserved. The images are commonly layered one on top of another over many generations, which allows their meaning and reasonings are open to continuous interpretation by contemporary rock art researchers and archaeologists. A large number of animal and human interactions and visual mergings are evident. And, okay, um, I was trying to look at the map closer and I guess I touched this. I did it again. Okay, let's get rid of this and wow, this is so beautiful. Oh god, I feel so dizzy. I hate it. I feel like I'm going to fall back and fall off. I, I am very afraid of heights. Maybe this will help me beat my fear because I'm really enjoying this. Like, in real life, I don't think I would stand this close to this cliff. I'm a klutz. I fall often. I trip over, like, nothing. So, yeah, I don't do climbing. But this is so cool that I get to do it in VR. And look at those stairs over there. That is so cool. I wish I had hands instead of the controls like a point. So I, I'm pointing when I wave with the controls. That's what I'm doing. So it looks really good. The plants look good. The boulders look amazing. And I really have a horrible feeling like I'm going to fall back off of it. it. It seems so realistic. Like I'm in, I'm in a bedroom right now. I'm totally safe. I'm on a flat surface with carpet under my feet. But I feel like I'm going to fall backward into, like, whenever I'm in a height, it makes me feel like I'm going to fall. And I have that feeling like it's real. It's so cool. This is, ah! And if I look up, I feel like I'm gonna fall. This is so beautiful. Wow. Okay, I have to, hang on a second, you guys. Um. No, okay. I was gonna sit down, but I think this is better standing and I'm gonna try to not fall over. I'll put my legs further apart so that I can brace myself. So these paintings are really cool. Now you have the other thing I wonder, these are rock paintings, they're beautiful, it's historical. Do you think in the olden days, the adults who saw this were like those darn graffiti artists? Look at their 
ruining our beautiful rocks. Do you think this was graffiti? Ancient graffiti and people got mad when they saw it? Or do you think they just did this to tell a story? Or I always think, what if it was graffiti? What if it made people mad when they saw it? But it's very nice. I see a deer and I see a man kind of waving. It's so cool. So, um... A is teleport. So let's teleport over to there. Okay. It's like I can literally, I feel like I can go sit on those rocks. It's just incredible, you guys. Can you imagine, like, setting up a little base camp here and having this as your view? You'd be kind of protected under these rocks from rain a little bit, maybe? So cool. This is such an amazing app. I'm really glad it worked. I was sad when, when it, sometimes they went, um... When, when I tried to open this before, it just kept crashing to to nothing like it just kept crashing so what I did was I restarted my oculus quest and, and then it worked and I also um I took off a few extra things to make more room I like it seemed like I had enough room but maybe it was struggling I don't know oh man look at that we can go into the dock but let's get a better a better position so we're not gonna fall off well it's not a dock it's like more like a deck but how cool that we can walk here I'm like blown away by this, you guys. And if I had a big enough house, I could actually walk. Like, if I went downstairs into the living room, I could still walk around a lot, but not enough. But how cool would it be to be somewhere where you could literally just walk and enjoy this? So it doesn't look like we can go further that way. But how cool is this? What does this say? Touch to continue to Cueva Pintada 2. Okay. Oh! Freaks me out when I'm on the ledge. Oh, look, there's a backpack. Oh, this would be a great place, like, if you had to sleep for the night somewhere. Cool. This is incredible! And there's still some uh, paint paintings up on these walls. There's layers and layers of painting. Look at the artwork. I see birds. Oh man. There's a backpack. Someone left a backpack. Can we bend down and look at it closer? Hi, little backpack. Oh man. How can I go? Ah! Why do I do this to myself? But look at this view. Oh, I feel nauseated now. I, I'm not good with heights. But look how beautiful that is. This is so gorgeous. I wish we could walk, like, instead of with teleporting, just push the little thingy and move forward. Like a more natural movement. It's still cool that we can do this. Can I go under here? I can. Oh my god, that is so cool. Can I go right here? Oh, I can. I better, oh, I'm gonna hit my head. Let's crouch down. This is so cool. You guys, this is like the coolest thing ever. I love this app. It is so amazing. I'm so glad I got it. And, and hopefully the developer will work out the little glitches. So this is absolutely unbelievably cool. I am blown away and it's so beautiful. What do you guys think of this? For better inspection of artwork, use R grip button to scale down and grab an L grip button to elevate and restore R. I don't have an R. I have a grab button, though. No? 
I don't know. So you guys, I thought this was really cool. And I'm not sure what this means about grabbing and scaling. Oh, okay, so when I click this button, I can elevate it, so I'm going lower. Okay, so I can see that better. I made it higher so we could see better, that's cool. I almost feel like sitting on the floor and lying down and I scale down. Scale back up. Elevate, not elevate. Okay, I get it. That's very cool. So let's go back over by the backpack. And, um, wow, you guys, this is so cool. Anyway, I think I'm going to leave this here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like button. And leave your comments. Let me know what you think about this place. And... Please subscribe and leave your comments. I love reading them. And as a small channel, it really helps. All right, guys, take care. And most importantly, stay safe. Bye for now.